and do another tier list video because my other tier list video, um, the Euro predictions video, hit and is currently on 1.2k views as of recording this video. So I thought I'd come on here and do another tier list video. But before I continue, please like and subscribe. I'm trying to hit 100 subscribers by the end of the year. We are 23 away from that target. So please hit the subscribe button. It's completely for free and it really does help support the channel. So let's get into this tier list video. As you can see, it's a very random assortment. And that is because I cannot take credit for this tier list. Um, I got this from Dido ASMR's YouTube channel, which I will link um, at the top of the screen. And he got his ASMR Twitch chat to essentially give him random things and he ranked them in a tier list style video. And I am going to do the same thing. So sit back, relax and enjoy this video, even though it is not ASMR style like Dido's, but maybe in the future I will do a Brit tries or non ASMR artist tries ASMR for the first time because I really, really enjoy it. It really helps me relax. And if any ASM artist were to stumble across this video, I'm super, super grateful for the work that you do. Um, even though ASMR is a pretty random, uh, or was a pretty random subject to start with, it's really, really growing and it helps me sleep, reduces my anxiety, etc. But yeah, let's get into this random tier list. So you've got S tier, A tier, B, C and D being the lowest tier. And you can see that we've got a load of random things. So we'll start with aeroplanes. Aeroplanes, I still, at the at the grand age of 20, I have still not gone on aeroplanes um, just because I have a little bit of fear of flying um, due to the autism element and the sensory overload type of thing. So I would put aeroplanes at the moment in the C tier because the flying element for me I'm not a particularly big fan of however I do like old war planes and like the modern super fighter jet um, planes um, so I put it in C tier because the hate of flying but also the the enjoyment that I get from watching planes take off etc it's a really really cool thing of course extremely loud the second one is alarm clocks, and alarm clocks are going straight in D tier. Yes, they may be useful for waking you up, but nobody really wants an alarm clock waking them up, a really loud noise just suddenly disrupting your sleep. It's just it's just the worst feeling in the world. There are going to be a lot of D tier things, I think, because some of these are very, very specific, and some of them, like this one, American football, is going to be is going to be a very controversial wherever I put it because sports are opinionated. Um, some people who like who love American football might put it in S tier. People who don't like it will put it in D tier. I get the the hype of the Super Bowl, like it's a massive event, but for me, American football is in D tier, below alarm clocks, just because I don't watch the sport. I watch actual football, like English football, um, I don't watch fake football. Androids. Is the, I'm guessing this is the phone brand. If it's the phone brand, I'm going to put it in B tier. I've never owned an Android, but obviously technology is, revolution, is revolutionising um, our world. Obviously, the creation of AI, if you were to look at androids in terms of robots and AI, it's revolutionising how we are as human beings, how we are as a society. However, people are worried that the AI might turn into Terminator 5 and start taking over the planet. But I'm putting it in B tier just because of the technologies evolving so quickly. And it's a very, very good 
uh, so, 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 potential solution to the world's problems. Ants, there's no there's no need for explaining. Ants are going in D tier just because they're annoying little bastards, um, and we don't particularly like them. ASMR, absolutely no doubt in my mind. ASMR is going in S tier. Ever since I stumbled across ASMR, it's changed how I sleep. It's changed my relaxation. It's really, really helped my my sleep schedule, and I've gotten I've had deeper, deeper sleeps now because of the ASMR. And I want to shout out a few content creators: Dido ASMR, obviously the guy who did this tier list, Jojo, uh, Slight Sounds, GB, uh, Roscoe ASMR. And a brand new ASMR artist that I've recently stumbled across, ASMR Isaac. Some really, really good content creators out there. And just go and go, go and sh show them some real love and support. And then RJ and J ASMR who stream on Twitch. I don't know the days, but they do Lego ASMR. And as a le big Lego fan myself, as a big Lego fan myself, I really, really enjoy the co the, the the content that they put out, the streams that they put out. They're really just a really lovely, friendly community over there. So go and check those guys out on Twitch as well. Candy is going in A tier. I love Candy personally. I'm a mass. I have a massive sweet tooth, but obviously the health reasons. Uh, obviously, too much candy will make you sick, and I just think. For that reason, it can't really go S tier. Car tyres, on the other hand, I apologise for this, and you're probably going to think, why is this? Why is he putting it there? I'm putting car tyres in S tier, just because me personally, if you've watched my content for some time now, you'll know that I'm a huge, huge petrol head, um, and obviously I know all different types of tyres, so Michelin, Pirelli. Um, and obviously all the F1 tires um, that they make, I'm just I'm just a nerd when it comes to tires and like the PSI, the different pressures. Um, I just I just love tires. I just I just love car tires. It's a bit of a weird sort of thing there. Carpet. Ooh, I'm gonna put carpet at the top of C tier because carpets are very very comfortable, um, but like they don't have any other use other than to stand on um in your house so they're pretty much useless other than that so i'm going to put carpet in c tier chicken nuggets on the other hand are going all the way up to a tier just underneath candy i love chicken nuggets especially again very controversial mcdonald's chicken nuggets are elite you can't get better than that comment down below if you think you can get better than that but Chicken nuggets are absolutely delicious, um, especially with sweet and sour sauce that you get from McDonald's. Oh, delicious. Chinese takeaway, on the other hand, my dad absolutely loves Chinese takeaway. It's one of his things that he always gets once in a while. Uh, Chinese takeaway for me, though, I'm going to put it top of top of B tier, just because I have had Chinese food before, but it's not my favourite takeaway. Um, I probably just have to, I, I, for that reason, I'm going to have to put it in B tier. Um, there are other better takeaway options. Uh, pizza takeaway. Um, yeah, just, just better takeaway options. Crinkle cut crisps. Oh, oh, crinkle cut crisps are so nice. Especially the the McCoy, uh, McCoy's crinkle cut crisps. Unbelievable. But should we put it in S tier or A tier? I think I'm going to put it bottom of A tier just because you can't get but crinkle cut crisps are not as good as chicken nuggets and candy door handles well door handles well you've got to put them in S tier because if you don't have door handles you wouldn't be able to get into your house like you wouldn't be able to get into any room possible which means you wouldn't be able to meet new people you'd be trapped in your house forever and it just wouldn't be good for the benefit of everybody. So door handles definitely going in S tier. Flowers, the top of A tier because flowers help us breathe. Um, they uh, they release oxygen, which helps us breathe. 
and obviously oxygen speaking of oxygen skipping ahead a little bit but oxygen will also be going in s tier because we'd be dead if it wasn't for oxygen so yeah halloween now halloween as an event is childish personally i think halloween is childish because um i get the i get the thing about trick-or-treating um knocking on people's doors getting the candy or potentially getting a little joke but i've outgrown halloween now it's it's just a pain in the bottom now really with people knocking on your door even though you, clearly you don't have any decorations out meaning you're not celebrating halloween however the films the halloween films with michael myers they are excellent my uh, i'm not a ma i'm not a massive horror fan like i hate anything that's jumpy or anything but but the michael myers halloween films one of, uh, are my favorite uh, one of my favorite films there is i'm currently making my way through all of the films from 1978 all the way up to 2022 and for that reason i'm going to put halloween in the middle i'm going to put it top of b tier for the event but also just the films themselves ikea personally as an autistic person i love ikea just because it's all laid out perfectly you you have to go through all the different sections to get to the section you want it's not it's not chaotic it's all orderly it's all perfectly measured and i'm also yet to try the ikea meatballs which apparently are meant to be really really nice so for me ikea are going to go middle of a tier above chicken nuggets below candy lego going up in s tier just just short of asmr because lego is well let me show you i have a massive lego collection this one i've just picked out is the lamborghini urus um super trofeo um special edition car but i've got a huge collection of lego cars i think i've got all the whole set um i've got 24 i've got 24 cars in the in my collection and i'm hoping to build on that as well lightning mcqueen is gonna go the top of a tier because as a as a child i loved the car movies and it, it's one of the reasons why I, i'm into cars now obviously top gear is the other reason but Lightning McQueen is a really, really great character in the Cars movies of it. And Owen Wilson is a great actor, great voice actor. And for that reason, Lightning McQueen is going top of A tier because you've got to love him. Marmite, on the other hand, is going in D tier because you either love it or you hate it. And I hate it. No more explanation needed. Mondays. Now, I commented on Dido ASMR's video of this on uh, on his channel, saying that Mondays are all right for me because due to my uni timetabling, I don't have any lectures at all on a Monday, which means I get technically an extra weekend, an extra weekend day. Um, so Mondays for me are pretty good. But obviously, I understand the tiredness and the boredom that people get with weekends so for that i'm gonna put it bottom of actually no middle of sea above aeroplanes pepper pig we'll skip past that porsche oh yes s tier s tier s tier again huge petrol head so porsche is it's a car brand so it's going top of s class but also porsche have made some of the best looking cars well not best looking cars but some of the best cars of uh, of, of our generation the porsche 918 that hybrid hypercar that came out in 2014 um the 911 range is super super good the panamera the Taycan, the new that electric car that's really good and then obviously you've got the racing cars like the porsche mission r electric hill climb monster excellent excellent car road signs are in a tier um bottom of a tier just because we probably wouldn't know where to go if it wasn't for road signs yes you've got sat nav but sat nav is built off road signs so 
if no if there weren't any road signs i think it would be i think driving would be really disorderly sharks are going middle uh top of b tier or just shy of the top of b tier because sharks are some of my favorite animals in the world um however it's really sad and that they're going extinct and also um my fear of the ocean uh and the reason why i don't i'm don't i'm not learning to swim is because i'm jaws petrified me and i'm i'm not going in the sea so that's that's why it's there socks i'm putting socks middle of s of middle of a tier because socks for me and please don't judge me for any other autistic people watching i you i wear my socks inside out because the seams are irritating on my feet it's a sensory issue um however obviously if you never wore socks your feet would always be cold apart from in the summer but again comment down below if this is a controversial thing or not but i wear socks in bed apparently that's a weird thing but i wear socks in bed so but yeah socks for me are middle of a tier the alphabet i mean it's pretty useless i mean yes it helps us to read and write but apart from that it's pretty it's a pretty useless thing the number seven obviously in terms of a number it's pretty useless it's just a number but obviously the the heritage that obviously the symbol the symbols that it holds obviously cristiano ronaldo's number for a very long time it was david beckham's number so in football it holds a lot of weight so for that i'm going to put bottom of b tier the sun is an annoying pain in the ass but obviously you wouldn't have it otherwise so i'm going to put sun second in a tier and then tiktok i have got fourteen thousand followers on tiktok so I'm going to put this slightly high, but because it's a social media app, I'm going to put it sort of middle of B tier. But yeah, that is my tier list. Let me know in the comments down below where you would put certain items on this list. Thank you very, very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.